Hey guys, Crayfish Carl here with another Droplet States of Matter update video. Early Access 1.7 is now available. Key features include a graphical and musical rework of Waterworks, a level found in the same hub world as Bonsai Bathhouse. Waterworks is one of the oldest levels ever created for the game. It served to prototype the great obstacles that all states of matter except for ice form can pass through. Early in development, I decided this was an important feature to have working, as it had to be integrated with the core collision handling of the whole game. Thematically, a sewer was the perfect setting to explore the idea, mixing gratings with water that could be frozen. The level has changed significantly since the early days. Not only are there new graphical effects, such as water reflections off the walls, but enemy placements have been altered to rebalance the difficulty. The level was in need of more aggressive underwater enemies, so a squid that chases you was added. Over in the latter half of the level, most of the platforms are very thin with little space for anyone other than the player character to walk on. Thus, a new flying enemy was introduced, a bat that shoots sonic waves. In other news, I've changed the tutorial in response to player feedback. Several new hints were added to better clarify certain aspects of the game. Additionally, after obtaining the green crystal, the door that leads back to the science expo opens again. That way, you can now go back and check to see if you missed any atoms in that area before moving on to Helium Valley. Finally, I've just recently crossed 1,000 followers on Twitter. To celebrate this milestone, there's a bonus devlog in the works where I cover one of the game's mysterious lost levels. If you want to hear the full story on that, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss the video when it comes out. And with that, thank you for watching.